Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Indian Army needs a rifle with more range and lethality. The ever reliable AK-47 does that but again has a range of about only 400 meters. It uses 7.62 into 39 mm bullet which is not effective at a longer range. This led to the emergency procurement of SIG 716 rifles. The rifle uses 7.62 into 51 mm bullet which is of higher caliber than AK-47 and at the same time gives a range of 600 meters. The 6716 has a higher caliber and is meant to shoot to kill at a longer distance. Indian Army has procured a total of 1.4 lakh SIG rifles under two separate contracts. However, Army faced a lot of issues with this new SIG rifles. First. The optical device meant for SIG rifles was not procured to reduce its cost. However, not having optical device has blinded the soldiers while operating in night and dark. Second issue was with its ammunition. While Americans sold the rifles smartly at a lower cost, its ammunition was very costly. As per the defense experts, a company might sell a rifle at a lower cost, but it makes better money through ammunition and servicing just like a car company. Third issue was with the grip of rifle. Indian soldiers were used to AK-47 which has comparatively shorter barrel and gave better grip. In fact, Army has further improved the grip of AK-47 rifles using wooden handles beneath the barrel. The fourth issue was with the recoil of the gun which is obvious. The American gun has higher caliber and range greater than AK-47 and INSAS rifle which means it will have more required. The challenge was that Indian Army is not used to operating rifles with higher required. So we have discussed four problems of 6716. Now we will talk about how Indian Army has smartly overcame these issues. To overcome the lack of optical device in the rifles, Indian Army integrated its already in-service sight system. While the existing sight system is not as accurate as the original one, but it does the job. The original sight system of 6716 has a pointer pointing on exact location where the bullet will hit. The pointer of sight system used by Indian Army will have minimal difference, but that's okay. With little bit of training, this on Indian the sight system, system is soldiers produced can by both in government issues and private companies. The second issue was with the ammunition which was very costly. To overcome this, Army replaced the original American make with locally manufactured and easily available rounds of 7.62 light machine gun LMG. However, this has slightly increased the recoil of rifle than with original bullet. Army is also planning to integrate a bipod with SIG rifles to be used in different scenarios. The third issue which we discussed was with its grip. Army has integrated additional kit with the rifle to provide it better grip even to those with shorter hands. The fourth issue was with recoil. This has however increased with the use of LMG rounds. Only the training on these rifles will help soldiers to get used to it. Overall, now if we look at 6716, it has become a formidable weapon now. With a bipod integration, it's almost like a light machine gun with more accuracy and lethality at a greater range. The weapon seems to be a good choice for the replacement of INSAS in the interim till the AK-203 enters the production. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.